Hello YouTube, my name's Chris, this is my channel I'm into, and today I'm into getting rid of chafing. So, chafing, what is it? Well, I'm sure most of you know what it is, but I'm going to tell you, it's where the skin rubs together and creates really quite a sore patch. It can be really uncomfortable. And it's something that's really common if you go to the gym or you go running or any kind of sports um, where you may get some rubbing. And it's particularly painful for people that are overweight, such as myself. Um, at the moment, I'm training at the gym um, on an every other day basis. And yeah, sometimes I can suffer with chafing. And so I'm gonna to recommend to you a little something that stops that. Now, there are other chafing options, anti-chafing options on the market, such as deodorants, and you can get special creams, etc., etc. However, I wanted something that was pretty cheap and which worked really well. And so I tried Vaseline one day. Now, it's not your normal Vaseline. Now, I did try normal Vaseline, and it did do the job. But this stuff that I've got here seemed to do a better job. And I think that's because it's got aloe vera in it. Now it's actually meant for lip therapy. However, I thought, well, why not use it as an anti-chafing solution? So I did, I used it as an anti-chafing solution and it worked absolutely wonders. The thing about Vaseline is that it takes ages to get off your hands when you're uh, trying to wash it off. But um, that's not a bad thing when it comes to anti-chafing solutions, especially, especially when you're exercising, because you don't want it to rub off as easily. So I tried it and it was absolutely brilliant, absolutely perfect. And yeah, well, with it having aloe in it as well, um, it kind of heals the skin as well, so it's, uh, it's fantastic. It lasts all the way through my session. Um, and look how small it is. It's a tiny little carton, um, a little tin, and I can just pop it in my bag and it's not going to take up much room. So, absolutely brilliant. So I'm no doctor, I'm no professional, I'm no expert in the health industry, on anti-chafing, on Vaselines, okay? This is just my experience that I'm sharing to you, just to help you out, okay? Now, what does it smell like, you may be thinking? It's hard to, um, it's hard to say. It smells like sweets to me. So it's not too bad. You know, it's neither masculine or feminine. So, you know, if you're bothered about that, then uh, that's not gonna, gonna get in the way of you buying it. So what else do I like about this little tin of Vaseline? Well, I've said it, it's little, it's a little tin. Tiny little tin, it can fit nicely into the bag or into a pocket, and you won't even notice it was there. So it's not gonna take up much room, brilliant. So it's just like any other Vaseline, apart from it's got aloe vera in it, as far as I'm aware. Um, so it's really nice and thick, and you just apply it on um, wherever you need it to go. What I suggest you do is you use a paper towel to wipe it off your hands first, and then you can wash your hands afterwards, and that just helps to get rid of it from your hands, which is the only downside, I think, to having Vaseline for an anti-chafing product. It's a nice little tin when it comes in. It's metal, um, 20 grams, and it's fully recyclable as well. And if you don't use it as an anti-chafing solution, it is, of course, for lip therapy um, originally anyway. So apply it to your lips. And so I hope you found this video useful. Um, and I hope it's going to be a good anti-chafing solution for you. Please feel free to subscribe. I'm going to be doing some more videos soon on other products. And so from me, Chris, and I'm into, goodbye for now.